I've got this uh, Warmoth Strat here that I'm putting up for sale. I wanted to show you uh, some of the things about it. It's got a roasted maple neck. This is War Warmoth's uh, standard thin profile. It's got um, Spurzel locking tuners, which are really nice. Roasted swamp ash body. This is just finished in like a true oil kind of thing. Uh, the pickups on this are really cool. These are the Fishman Fluence Strat pickups. And so they, uh, they're they completely noiseless. They sound great and they have two different voicings. They have like kind of a, a more chilled out kind of 50s voice uh, and then um, a more sort of black face, you know, a little bit louder, a more mid forward kind of voice. Right now I've got it uh, in the more mid, in the more, uh, the louder, the more mid forward, mid forward sort of voice because I've got this, I don't know if you can tell from the video, I've got this tone control pulled out. That's a push-pull pot, and that's how you activate the two voices. I'm running it through a divided by 13 FTR37. That's going through a Boss uh, Waza tube amp expander, and then right into Logic. Uh, right, that what you just heard was uh, into the clean channel of the divided by 13 with a Sarno Earth Drive, just kind of a little, a little bit of touch of overdrive on that in the louder uh, pulled out voice on the neck pickup. I'm just going to take you through all the sounds real quick here and uh, let you hear what it sounds like. It's a really, really cool set of pickups, a cool sounding guitar. This is clean, earth drive off with uh, the, uh, the tone pop pushed in, so this is the more vintage kind of voice here on a clean channel. So you can just check this out, let's see. I'm going to switch it up 
switch over to the what they call the click channel on the Vita 13. It's a little bit a little bit dirtier, um, kind of I don't know maybe in the same family something like a Vox or or a Tweet Ant maybe, uh, but I like it. For that, I like it for that kind of. Um, as you break up country tone. quite a bit. I'll switch it back to the clean channel here and uh, I'm gonna go back to the uh, back to the neck. I'm gonna pull this tone pot out here. So now we're in that hotter voice. There it is. Here's with it in. Here's with it out. for lead. I think if I had to pick one set of voices I would go with the with a little bit of a hotter voice because you can still dial it back and and I'll maybe turn on some drop. It's a great sound there. I'll go here down to this, uh, it's still in this hot voice uh, in the fourth position here with the drive on. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
them is really nice. It's just that kind of subtle, you know, subtle tremolo, which is what I like. channel in about a 13. <laughs> which allows me to turn on both channels of the better by 13 at the same time. I'm gonna do that with the overdrive on the bridge, everything maxed out here. sloppy plan but it gives you a pretty good idea of what it sounds like plays great um, great tuners you know I love these pickups it's really light uh, it's a cool guitar hope you dig it <laughs>